I take you back to page number two? Sure. And about, this is something that caught my eye, but about the middle of the page, mm -hmm. it says, the line items that are over are professional services, engineering, vehicle and equipment maintenance for 13 and 8 12. Yes. And then it says, the major line being vehicle and equipment maintenance on the D7. Prior to the equipment fire, it had been to Yancey for repairs due for lack of maintenance. Right. I, I've got I've got a question here. Are we saying that it had to go in for repairs because we did not do maintenance on this piece of equipment? While we had it at Yancey, we did repairs on it. So we had repairs that were a result of the fire. But then we also had other result, other results of lack of maintenance that required repairs. Does that make sense? Well, well, no, it doesn't so, make sense. so not all of it in, in being repaired by Yancey Brothers, not all of it was covered under our insurance your, policy. Your part makes sense. The necessity of it makes no sense to me. Right. Um, <laughs> if, uh, if we have a director out there and we have an administrative assistant out there and they can't keep up with Deferred maintenance when it was still under <coughs> landfill, not under public work. The long term. But land, but but landfill asked public works for maintenance on it, but it didn't always get done. We always have somebody to blame. Up here. You know this uh, thir thirteen thousand eight hundred dollars being spent for lack of maintenance is a uh, you know needs to stop. 